sclerotic scatter is used to view corneal abnormalities such as localised edema. It utilises the phenomenon of total internal reflection such that light at the cornea-air interface is reflected completely within the cornea. Sclerotic scatter is best performed by using the decoupling technique. First, focus light on the central cornea and lock the slit lamp. Remember to tell your patient to fixate on your ear or another distant object. Then, decouple the illumination system from the observation arm. Then, move the illumination beam so that it is on the temporal limbus. You can then magnify the central cornea to look for opacities. Don't forget to recouple the slit lamp when you're finished. If you don't decouple the slit lamp, you must not look through the observation system. As you can see, by moving the coupled slit lamp illumination beam to the temporal limbus, only half the cornea is in view, much less so as you increase the magnification. Therefore, Always use a decoupling technique to view the central cornea for sclerotic scatter.